darling, gather round. Let me introduce you to a force of nature, a voice that could silence a storm and a presence that could light up the darkest night. She is Lady Blackbird, and trust me, she's about to paint the town red in the most fabulous shade of jazz. They call her the Grace Jones of jazz. And darling, it's not hard to see why. She's got that same captivating aura, that blend of power and vulnerability that makes you want to lean in and listen. Her voice, oh honey, her voice is something else. It's rich and soulful with a depth that could rival the ocean. But Lady Blackbird is more than just a singer. She's an artist, a storyteller, a weaver of emotions. She takes the classics and makes them her own, injecting them with a raw, contemporary energy that'll leave you breathless. Get ready to be enchanted because Lady Blackbird is here and she's ready to take the world by storm. Every legend has a beginning and for Lady Blackbird, that beginning was in the church. Picture this, a young girl, barely more than a child, standing in the choir loft, her voice soaring above the pews. That, my darling, was the genesis of a star. Growing up in a religious household, gospel music was her first love. It was in those hymns and spirituals that she discovered the power of her own voice, the way it could move people, touch their souls. It was a training ground like no other, shaping her vocal prowess her emotional delivery, and her innate ability to connect with an audience. The church wasn't just where she learned to sing, it was where she learned to feel. It was where she discovered the depths of human emotion, the joy and the sorrow, the hope and the despair. And it was these raw, unfiltered emotions that would later become the heart and soul of her music. But darling, the path to stardom is rarely smooth. It's paved with its fair share of wrong turns, potholes and detours. And Lady Blackbird's journey was no exception. Signed to a major label in her late teens, she found herself boxed in, pressured to conform to the industry's narrow definition of success. They wanted pop hits, chart toppers, but that wasn't her. It wasn't her truth. Years passed filled with frustration and disillusionment. She almost gave up, almost walked away from the dream. But darling, true talent has a way of refusing to be silenced. Deep down, Lady Blackbird knew she had something special to offer, a story that needed to be told. And then, like a phoenix rising from the ashes, came Blackbird. This wasn't just a song, it was a revelation. Her haunting rendition of Nina Simone's classic sent shivers down spines and brought tears to eyes. It was raw, it was powerful, it was Lady Blackbird, completely and unapologetically herself. Released in 2020, it took the world by storm. Suddenly, everyone was talking about this voice, this incredible talent that had been hidden for far too long. The song wasn't just a cover, it was a statement, a declaration of independence, a refusal to be anything other than her authentic self. Blackbird wasn't just a breakthrough, it was a rebirth. It was the moment Lady Blackbird truly found her voice, the moment she stepped into her power and showed the world what she was capable of. Section 5. Nobody's Sweetheart. Conquering the UK Charts. Darling, hold on to your hats because things were about to get exciting. Hot on the heels of Blackbird came Nobody's Sweetheart, a sassy, soulful anthem that became her signature tune. This wasn't your grandma's jazz. This was jazz for a new generation, infused with a modern sensibility and a whole lot of attitude. The UK, always ahead of the curve, darling, embraced her with open arms. 
Nobody's Sweetheart climbed the charts, becoming a radio staple and cementing her status as a rising star. It was official. Lady Blackbird had arrived. But it wasn't just the charts where she was making waves. Critics raved about her unique sound, her powerful stage presence, and her ability to connect with audiences on a deeply emotional level. The buzz was deafening and the world was watching. Section 6 Black Acid Soul, a triumphant debut. And then, Darlings, came the moment we'd all been waiting for. The release of her debut album, Black Acid Soul. This wasn't just an album. It was a masterpiece. From the opening notes to the final chords, it was a journey into the heart and soul of a true artist. The album was a tapestry of sound and emotion, weaving together jazz, soul and blues with a contemporary edge. It was raw, it was vulnerable, it was powerful, and it was undeniably Lady Blackbird. Critics hailed it as one of the best albums of the year, praising its originality, its emotional depth, and of course, Lady Blackbird's stunning vocals. Awards nominations followed, along with sold-out tours and a growing legion of devoted fans. Lady Blackbird wasn't just a star, she was a supernova. Section 7, Slang Spirituals, Exploring New Dimensions. But darling, a true artist never stands still. They're always evolving, always pushing boundaries, always exploring new dimensions of their craft. And Lady Blackbird is no exception. Her latest offering, Slang Spirituals, is a testament to her artistic growth and her restless creative spirit. It's a bolder, more experimental album, delving deeper into electronic soundscapes and pushing the boundaries of jazz even further. Slang Spirituals is a sonic adventure, a journey into the unknown. It's a celebration of black music in all its forms, from its roots in gospel and blues to its future in electronic and experimental sounds. It's a bold statement from an artist at the top of her game, an artist who refuses to be confined by genre or expectation. Section 8. Lady Blackbird takes the stage, the upcoming tour. Hold on to your dancing shoes, my darlings, because Lady Blackbird is going on tour. That's right, she's packing her bags, her incredible voice, and her band of merry musicians, and hitting the road to bring her music to the masses. This isn't just a concert, darling. It's an experience. It's a chance to see a true artist at work, to be swept away by her voice, her presence, and her undeniable charisma. Trust me, you'll be talking about it for weeks. So, grab your tickets, put on your dancing shoes, and get ready for a night of pure musical magic. Lady Blackbird is coming to town, and she's bringing the house down. Section 9. Strictly Come Dancing, a new stage, a new rhythm. And darlings, the excitement doesn't stop there. I have it on good authority that Lady Blackbird will be gracing us with her presence on none other than Strictly Come Dancing. Yes, you heard that right. 